Hey everybody, it's July 13th and I wanted to share some clips and uh, pictures of my very first one pound tomato. Well, Lee Davidson was nice enough to send me these seeds and his grandfather has been growing these uh, tomatoes for I believe right around 50 years now. Well, he didn't have a name for them so I, I just been calling them Davidson tomatoes. So here's the, here's my big boy. So. Getting ready to pick it, throw it on scale, and see what we got here. This is the very first cluster. There we go. Let's see if she'll make it. Beautiful looking tomato. Alright, drum roll. One pound, five eighths ounces. It doesn't matter if it's one pound fifteen or one pound five eighths. One pound tomato is a one pound tomato. And I am one happy dude. Well, it took me a long, long time to get to finally hit the, the one pound club, and so I'm pumped. I'm excited, and as you can see by my. <laughs> I am pumped. I still can't believe it. So I'm just sitting here looking at it like, man, I finally, finally grew a one pound tomato. So, all right, so we're going to take a look at the rest of the plant. And this is part of the first cluster, but this is a beautiful plant. Um, this thing really took off. It's uh, producing a lot of tomatoes and it's grown and grown and grown. So, they can only have some pretty nice sized tomatoes coming come in the center. So, I only have a 6 foot by 8 foot greenhouse, but it is 8 feet tall. But I'm thinking I might have to prune this thing pretty pretty soon. So, it's already starting to wrap over to the, to the other side of the greenhouse now. Big ones all over. Well, it seems like on every video, somebody asks, um, what PPMs I'm running? I'm running 1,000 PPMs. This DWC bucket, and I'm using Hobby Formula from Hydro Gardens, 10822. So, and they're out of a uh, Golden Springs, Colorado, I believe. But roots look great. DWC is a uh, kicking butt. All right. Well, here's a view of uh, the Oregon coast. Here, this is where I live, and this is our summer. So we get lots of fog. Average temperature around 64 degrees, so it's a real struggle to grow tomatoes um, without growing them in a greenhouse or hydroponics. I'd I'd have a really really hard time getting a tomato. Probably would never be able to get a one pound tomato. So I feel really fortunate. I actually uh, I'm lucky. I actually uh, started growing hydroponics. So without it, I have zero chance of getting this one pounder. Well, guys, as always, thanks for taking the time to. To watch and comment and have a great summer.